Well, hello and of course welcome back to Wheel Puppets once again. Now, we've been busy. Yes, we've had some live shows to deal with as well, which is always great, of course, in these times, to be back live with uh, small amounts of the public. So, uh, that's been great. But, back to our puppet builds. Well, um, in a moment or two, or towards the end of this little video, and it won't be very long, um, I'm going to show you uh, a build we're working on, which all it takes is sponges, like for cleaning your car, okay, and your rubber cement or your contact adhesive, whatever you're using there. Uh, no uh, uh, cutters, no uh, no scissors even at the moment, at least for the internal part of the structure of uh, what's turning out to be one of our biggest builds. How about that? I'll show you that in a moment or two. Uh, but first, what um, what have we been working on. Well, you know we've worked with Terry Pin, okay? So we'll go and have a look at Terry Pin in a moment in action. Um, uh, not quite happy with his eyes yet, um, but we're getting there. On the next one, we should have that. Uh, we've got Alien One. I'll give you a little demo with Alien One and uh, her joint arm rod to iMac. Um, and then we'll take a look at the new alien we've been building, followed by our biggest build yet. Oh, and uh, a little look. We'll look at this now, actually, because right here. Um, guess what these are? Can anybody guess what these are? Yes! Finally! We seem to have worked out Scooter's hair. Okay, so uh, it's coming along quite nicely. So Scooter's hair, we've still got to make a new Scooter head um, because uh, we haven't got there yet. We got distracted with everything else. But let's move on, shall we? Let's move on. Come over here into the studio. Uh, this isn't the workshop. This is the studio area, uh, green screen, as you can see. So uh, over here, we do have our Terry pin. So uh, let's have a look. Uh, good old Terry pin. Here he is. So, uh, this, everyone, let me grab the controller. This, everyone, is a Terry Pin. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, 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 I do beg your pardon, yes. I, oh, oh, there you are. Howdy doody. Oh, it's so, so great to be uh, uh, up and about. Oh, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Oh, Hello. Oh, hello, Terry. Terry, yes, Terry it is. Terry Pin. Oh, that's what they call me. Oh, yes. How are you? I'm well, thank you, and it's good to have you um, with us and here in the studio. Yes, and everybody else is coming on too. <gasps> oh, golly gosh. Anyway, I'm off now. Tiddle pip. Hup, hup, so. <clears throat> are you still there? Yes, go. So there we go. That's uh, Terry Pin. You yep, Terry Pin, and don't you dare forget it. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Terry. Okay, let's pop you down there. So uh, Terry Pin seems to be working all right. Uh, uh, just so we haven't made any voices for these characters yet. I'm <laughs> just making it up as I go along. Going with the flow. So let's take a look at the alien. You've been following the alien for a while because they had some trouble. You know, with IMEX, it's always trouble with mechanisms, you know. Uh, in fact, uh, animatronic IMEX seem to be much easier because you haven't got to work out all these things. Just Anyway, 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 pros and cons, right, pros and cons. So, let's have a look at one of our one-eyed wheel puppet alien. These are really good. I mean, look, see, you can stand on my hand. I mean, this is a nice, sturdy, but lightweight, um, I must say. I must think how I... Get into him. Um, okay, I say him. Um, uh, these are unisex, non-gender. Now look, here's the remote. The remote controls his eye, as you can see, quite easily and nicely. Okay, but also his uh, her arm as well. Oh gosh, here we are once again, ladies and gentlemen, ladies, 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 gentlemen. Oh. It's you. Yes, it's me. And uh, we're here showing you off. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> I see you. <gasps> yes, you. Hmm. Young Timmy, I'm watching you. Yes, Timmy. 
Are you being funny? I'm being funny. Good. Now, uh, we've made a mate for you. Oh! Can you believe it? A mate? Yes, a mate. Wouldn't you like that? You wanted a mate, right? Is it that one over there? Oh! <gasps> he looks sexy. Hey, shh! We don't know who's watching. Oh, hi! Anyway, cheerio! Oh! <laughs> yeah, so there is uh, one of our aliens on a bit of a mission. Um, uh, and uh, feels nice, feels good, um, very, very sturdy. Um, it's nice to have the arm mech uh, connected to the eye mech. We could have both arm mechs and the little trigger, you know, so it can clap and things like that. But that's one man controlling that, you know. Most of our puppets are two men puppets, or ideally. Um, so, so really, really happy with that so far. Let me know what you think. But as she, he just said, that uh, we've been building them a partner. Is it that one over there? Yes, it is. Only the head so far, so uh, I don't know whether they're gonna like you looking at them when it's just the head. Um, the body is to come. So uh, let's come over into the workshop. Um, and here he is, he, she, he, she, he, she. Um, now this one, same again. Um, mechanism's much, much longer, longer uh, cable. Um, just makes for easier uh, use, whether it's one of you or two of you, or you know, whether you're sitting down or standing up or whatever the case is. Obviously, um, it has the arm rod ready to be attached. And uh, here we go, look at that for a beautiful eye. Oh, golly, golly gosh. Yes, here we are once again live and I'm here and... <gasps> What's up? Where's my body? Your body? We haven't made your body yet. Why not? Because, because we've been so busy making your lovely face. My lovely face, it's no good without a lovely body, is it? I know it might not be any good without a lovely body. What about that one over there? You can't have that one over there. Why not? Because it's green for a start and it's not your body. I don't care if it's not my body. And I don't care, I like green. What? I like green. Well, why didn't you say so before? We, we, we made you red. Red? <gasps> Are you telling me I'm red? Yeah, well, you know, you don't really have a choice now, do you? And what's that thing there? Well, that's got your arm attached. It hasn't got my arm attached to it. Yeah, well, it will have your... You said you haven't made my... I haven't made your body. <sighs> what's this? This? You're being filmed. <gasps> filmed?! So there is uh, there's a red one coming on quite nicely as well. I'm really liking the red actually. The red seems to work pretty well. So let's pop that there. There we go. So with that done so far, the body still be made for that with the little muscly bits and so forth, just like the the, the green one, um, and uh, our aliens will be available to you anywhere in the world, as long as, of course, you're happy to pay your shipping. Um, right, we're also working on uh, Wembley. I'm sure you recognise this. We've had, uh, we've been doing a, um, a few a few shots with uh, with Wembley. Um, <laughs> Wembley uh, can be more tricky than you think. But anyway, we'll see how we go with that. We've uh, been making our capes for our aliens. This is the gold one. The other one's wearing the silver one. Um, there's a few of those made. And um, we've uh, been still building Scooter, but finally, I wanted to show you what can you build using these, okay? Need a little sponges. Now, here in South Africa, um, they cost about eight rand, okay, um, for this size and this density, which is quite good, actually, right? You could actually spray straight onto this if you wanted to, or coat it with latex or something. Um, but anyway, <clears throat> so we've got a box of sponges, all right, and um, um, what can you do with them? Well, I'm going to tell you. I wanted to make a dragon, okay, and my inspiration for this dragon was uh, Falcor. Is it Falcor? Yeah. Falcor from um, Never Ending Story. Okay, so uh, that's kind of my inspiration. It may not turn out like that, who knows, all right? But I started. 
and I'm using just these sponges and rubber cement. Okay, no carving knives as of yet, no scissors as of yet, and I'm really impressed so far. And this is going to be our biggest build so far. The dog might start barking in a minute, but let's take a look. So, here he is. What do you think? Let's, uh, let's bring him up here a minute. Now, he's not attached together or anything yet, but if you look, there he is. You see? Okay, so this will be the bottom jaw, and all it is... All it is, is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those uh, sponges we showed you a moment ago. And then, this is a lot more of those sponges, but exactly the same again. Um, and just carving them round as we've glued them and as the glue's dried to give us that general shape. Now, none of this is hollow yet. So I've got to carve it out at the back here for the arm to go in, join them together. Um, and these are going to have those beautiful big Imex, the same as the aliens, but two, of course. Uh, two, well, I could do one, but for the first build, we're going to do two, okay? I would like to do a single Terry pin with a single eye, big eye. And the same with, you know, all of our creations with one eye. Um, but we'll do this with two, make it a proper dragon down there. And then uh, he'll come over the shoulder into the tail here. The control for the eyes will be in the tail or they can be here, wherever you want them really. A one-man or a two-man puppet. The tail can move and uh, his eyes can blink and his mouth. Um, so so that's, uh, that's the plan and um, there it is. So far. Hope you enjoy it. Till next time.